Take Away the A by Michael Escoffier and Chris D. Giacoma. This is an alphabet book. Take away the A. Take away the A. Take away the A. This is the introduction of the book by Michael Escoffier and illustrated by Chris Diagamo. This is an alpha beast of a book. Woohoo! Without the A, scariest and hairiest. The beast is the best. So if you take out the A, beast is now best. Let's see? Without the B, the bride goes for a ride. Without the C, the chair has hair. Without the D, dice or ice. Ooh. Ho, ho, ho. The, the mice, the goo, the mouse, the goose, everybody's playing cards. Hmm. That's kind of interesting. Without the E, bears stay behind bars. Without the F, the scarf hides a scar. Skeleton. Without the G, the glove falls in love. Without the H, the three climb a tree. The three cats, because they're hiding from the dog. See? They're scared. It's a bad dog. He's barking up the tree. Without the I... Stairs lead to the stars. Wow. The owl has climbed up the stairs to now get to the stars. Without the J, it's jam I am. Without the K, that elephant's carrying a purse. Uh oh. Look at that banana, it's 25 cents. But without the K, the monkey makes money. See? He's giving him money. He's got his little hat on. He's selling those bananas for 25 cents a piece. Without the L, the plants wear pants. Can, can you imagine pants wearing plants? That's hilarious. Without the M, look at that, he's driving a car. The farm is too far 
That's why he has the car. That's why he's laughing. Because he has a car. So the farm is too far when you take out the M, huh? There's the farm. It's a long, long road. Without the N... Moon says, moo. It's the cow jumping over the moo instead of the moon. Ha, ha, ha. It's a cow, all right, with horns. Without the O. Look at there, they're, they're eating. With the fox and a deer. Without the O, the four, wear fur. So they all have fur on because we took out the O. So now four is fur. Hey, kind of interesting, isn't it? Without the P, there's a plate of food and a mouse carrying... Uh-oh, what are they up to? The plate is too late. <gasps> the cat ate the mouse because he was... The plate came too late. Uh-oh. Bye-bye, mousey. There's the mouse trying to hurry up and get the plate to him. Without the Q, you see that? This is going to get interesting here. Without the Q, I want you to know a new word. The facure goes to the fair. So we took out the Q to make the word fair. But... This gentleman here's name is Facure. And I did do something extra for you to make you understand what a Facure is. This is how you say it. Facure is a Muslim, Sufi, holy man or woman who lives on only what he or she begs for. So it's pronounced Fakur. It's a Hinduism name. So just wanted to let you know what that was, okay? But when we take out the Q from Fakur, we have a fair. Yay! Without the R. Ooh, what do we got? A lobster? Oh, we got a crab. <gasps> Without the R. The crab hails a cab. Hails means he's trying to stop that cab. He needs a ride. But the cab driver's a goose, and I don't think he sees him. Without the S, snow falls now. So you could be on the beach, and if you don't have an S... And now, you will get snow. That's funny. Is the sun shining over here? Without the T. Boats get boas. Do you know what that means? Boats carry boas. Boas are snakes. See them? So, without that T... We have a bunch of boas on our boat. See? So we want that tea back. So we have a boat back. Without the U. My aunt is an aunt. So your aunt, Donna, could be the little black ant 
that's eating dinner with the rest of the ants. And so that's what that is. So if you take the U from Aunt Sue or Aunt Donna, you have an ant like a black ant. Without the V. Ooh, there's a wolf. You see that? <gasps> seven are seen. So there's seven little dwarfs. Remember that? So there's seven that are seen when you take out the V. But I think that's all we have is seven, right? And we're taking out the V. Without the W? Uh-oh, what's going on here? The witch has an itch. So she's trying to scratch her back, so she has to use that broom because she can't reach back there where she's itching. So the witch has the itch. And that cat and the mouse are looking at her funny. Like, what is she doing? Without the X, the chicken's now looking confused here, huh? Foxes are foes. And do you know what that means? Foxes usually get along, but if they're foes, they don't get along. They wrestle with each other and they argue with each other, so they're not friends anymore. So when you take out that X, foxes are now Foes. And we don't want that to happen, do we? That's why the chicken's looking like that. Without the Y? What is going on there? A plane? Yours is ours. So... You're out there, and you're just ours. So, we took out the Y. So, it's your jump, but it's our problem, isn't it? Without the Z? We cannot sing our ABCs. That would not be any fun. Because we sing ABCs every day because we like to sing. And that is my story of the ABCs. And we know the rest of the story, don't we now? You see all the ABCs? So sing it with me. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now we know our ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? Yay! Take away the A. I hope you enjoyed the story.